What's up guys, welcome to the Homeless Crusade and we are currently at the Tournament of Might and as you can see, yes, I have a t-shirt for everything that's how it is Okay, so we're going to show you what's going on today I'm entering the tournament as well, I'm not going to get far, I know this for a fact, but it's all good So, let's wrap up today and see what's going on What's up guys, I got my homie Avon with me, Kenichi, Rapid Mate on all the socials. So he's actually the one who helped plan the tournament today that we're at now. But I turned out as dope, we actually got a full roster today which is lacquer. Yeah, Not very, very, very excited for that. Uh, we wanted to hit a minimum of 8 players. We got 12, so like I can't ask for any more than that. I'm very happy. So like, we, not a lot of us don't know what the gaming table is really about because like this is the first event they're actually having in PN. I know we spoke about it and I know you're going to do a lot more. Yeah. And Dragon Ball Fighter Z, I think is a nice start because it's a very fast paced action game. You hop on, you get your ass handed to you, hop off quick, quick. Yeah. So like tell us more about like what the gaming table is about. Like what, besides the fighting to game tournaments like the you're hosting right now, what else do they do? Okay, cool. So the gaming table is just a, a collective of like like-minded gamers that is just there for like the passion of just playing games. And instead of running to like a wiki, you can actually go into the table and have a conversation with guys that been playing games before. So like myself and Marlon started it back in the day and then how that came about was he introduced me to Dark Souls and I had no idea how to play good Dark Souls, but he could guide me through that. And then we met people in Cape Town. Uh, Gideon that did the flyer mm. and then uh, Nasir and a couple of other homies as well so we're just a group of guys that want to play video games and during COVID I wanted to push first person shooters uh. but that kind of didn't work out and then fighters came my way and I used to play fighting games back I, in the day. I, I used to play fighting games with you all the time like yeah. one of our games we used to play all the time was Marvel vs Capcom, Capcom so yeah yeah so like I even borrowed your profile to play the game before yeah, like I used to have it on my Xbox so, that's, so yeah that's what it all yeah, was about man. yeah no I get you so um okay so today when you were playing who is your main in fighter Z? Fighter Z, my main is my my main main that's always there is definitely adult go on I'm an adult go on fan <laughs> uh but my main team is 18 adult uh, go on and then base Goku and then I'm starting to switch it up with Goku Black, Adult Go on and Super Saiyan Goku. Oh dope, that sounds like a solid roster <laughs> actually. Yeah. I know you were very intimidated by my Videl game earlier but it's all good, Videl for life. Videl just gives headaches, it's <laughs> one of those things just like a real Videl player is a nightmare. Ah. You heard it from Avon yourself, guys. But anyways, Kenichi, it's been good, homie. Yeah, and just I a quick it. shout out to, to the, the to other homies. So firstly, just to let you guys know, thanks to the gaming table, because of them, uh, the prizes will be uh, really cool. Limited, not limited edition, but Dragon Ball Super. I think it's uh, number 18. The winner walks away with this. Thank you to Kudasai. They will be... We'll some be doing serious this. Backs. Some this is actually a oh the gods yeah the gods tradables. they're giving away gods and then we've got the stickers over here and this is the t-shirt that I'm wearing and over there big shout out to UGC they've been helping us out in Johannesburg we are bu busy building the anime t the anime fighting game scene right now oh dope and dope. Um, lastly if I'm forgetting anyone B and B crew. Tsunami boy and CX nice, thank you for always training me and bra win. Can I can I can I cast? Yeah, I don't want to just peep it out in the Okay, we are in who would have thought like mm. we in like beautiful PE, Port Elizabeth, uh, QB, Q whatever you wanna GQ, sorry. GQ, yeah. We here and we're playing fighters. Yeah. And there's gonna be way more to come. Yeah, one hundred. And we'll be here to cover all of them. So guys, we'll Please. see you at the next one as well. But for now, let's get some more interviews done. Shot homie, Cheers. I appreciate Shot, it. Man. Shot kid. What's up guys? Okay, so I got my homie Christo, got my homie Monde, and they took part in the tournament as well. So Monde was apparently literally setting people on fire earlier. <laughs> We're not gonna get into that a bit too much, but yo guys, okay, cool. So they fellow artists as well, that's actually how I know these guys, and I couldn't wait to get them on to like, a chat to us, because I didn't know they like anime as well. But here we yeah, are. Yeah, yeah, you have to cool. like the anime. You have to like, have the, to like anime. the anime. Cool. So guys, so how was the experience today? What what happened? What did, what did you guys get up to? Well, a lot of fun for me. Uh, got to see a lot of old faces that I haven't yeah, seen yeah. in a while. Which we haven't is good. seen a lot of these guys in a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice talking games and uh, mm. anime as, as usual. Mm. Or, yeah. Whatever goes on that we find cool and exciting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How about you, Um, I enjoyed it. I have to say, like, I mean, I didn't 
I just took a risk. Like uh, uh, he invited me on Facebook too. Yeah, I got that invite from Kevin yeah, on Facebook, yeah. and I told my man Monday. And then he, he invites likes his DBZ. <laughs> <laughs> he loves playing his DBZ. Uh, and yeah, I mean like invite towards uh, him. And then like, I just decided to register. I thought, let me just take a chance. And like, it's a cool vibe because mm. I feel like uh, it's what's needed. You know yeah. what I mean? Like sometimes you play games with your friends and it's more like a drinking situation. And it's mm. not like formal. And it's kind of like you, you wonder, okay, what if it's in a setting where we have like uh, a league? Because you watch YouTube yes. and you see all the guys overseas mm. and they got like leagues and they got like shirts, they got chairs. Yeah. God, yeah, I want those yeah. chairs. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Monday just wants a t shirt and stuff, guys. It looks like he's like skimping yeah, for. Yeah, on that Red Bull right he, He's skimping for Avon to make like, uh, what's the name? The gaming table, Dragon Ball Fighter Z t shirt. So, Avon, if you're watching the video back, homie, yes, please. Monday requests a t shirt, just so you know. Um, okay, so I know Monday into the tournament as well. Monday, who is your main when you play Fighter Z? What like uh, your the main character? The, the, you always pick. I always pick Yamcha because I just like what? He's a fun character for me. Dang. Like he, he, he's not overpowered. Yeah, I get that, but it's like because I bought the game like a month ago. So basically, okay, 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 okay. I'm playing with him just to get like used to uh, the, the, the the game mechanics. And I know uh, he's like uh, a, a lot of people are judging you right now. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> it's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You know, like but anyway, like um, Yamcha and that I kind of like him. I kind of like him. I got the same earlier when I picked Videl. People were like, "Why is Kevin picking Videl?" I was like, "Watch these 13, 14 hit combos, guys." <laughs> That's why. I I mean, like with a low tier character. That's like. Yeah, you, that's a lot of. That's is a salt lot. Thing. That's like yeah. It's like uh, ocean level salt. Yeah, you know, just, <laughs> just rub it in there. Just, just rub it in yeah. there. You want just Broly? I bet you what? Yeah, yeah. You you, you leave like you leave crumbs behind. Like the salt crystallizes and <laughs> how like, bad the wood is. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Salty. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you. But no, I agree with you, bro. Like um, we used to actually have tournaments in PE. A lot of fighting games were concerned. And the scene did kind of die, so I'm very glad the, the gaming table is actually bringing it back like full, yeah. full, full swing. Starting off Fighter Z, we have no clue what's next, but we hope there's going to be more. So we'll probably some cover. Them. Yeah, definitely some Tekken. <laughs> yeah, Funny it. enough, we, we not long ago we oh, actually yeah. did a we did a no 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 we did a Tekken interview, which is going to pop up on the channel soon. So yeah, I was a, I was feeling a bit iffy about seven, but I played eight and I'm back now. I'm yeah. a fan again from over. So but hopefully we'll we'll have the Tekken eight or whatever next. But guys, thank you very much. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Thanks for having us. Catch you on the flip side. Are we? You can follow, what's the, the art page again? I think four blind mice. Oh no, don't no, worry about it. doesn't exist anymore. No, <laughs> but if you guys go to the tramway's parking lot and you see the big massive mural against the wall, like right at the back of the parking lot, yeah, yeah. these guys did it. Yeah. That's how I know them. But anyways, guys. Thanks. What's up, guys? So I've got Mark here from The Den. He runs the store that we are having the Dragon Ball Z Tournament of Might in today. Okay. Cool, Mark. So just fill us in a little bit about the den itself. I've been here before, so I know exactly what you do. But for those who are watching that don't know anything about the store, just let us know what the shop is about, what you guys sell, what you guys do. So basically, we sell board games, card games, little miniatures, war games, uh, collectibles, and stuff like that. But mostly, we focus on card games and board games. Um, uh, we run tournaments for Pokemon, Magic, Warhammer. Uh, there's a, a newish game that's just come out, Marvel Crisis as well, it's also a little okay. miniature game. Mm -hmm. uh, we play with little Marvel characters, that's also pretty cool. Um, we're actually looking to get into the One Piece card game, but mm -hmm. there's none of that in SA at the moment. There's only a few select retailers that have it. Mm -hmm. um, we're looking to get into that as well. Um, but yeah, basically we're a store that sells these type of games, these like face-to-face, -face, you know, face-to-face -face type of yeah. games, not, not more of your online stuff, but it's mostly face-to-face -face games, and then we host events for the games that we ha uh, have in the shop. Um, we host our games are basically on Wednesday nights, Friday nights, Saturdays and Sundays during the day. So, hmm. yeah. Awesome, so that there are actually events and tournaments that do happen yes, at yes, the store that yes. guys can come play. Because I see that today there actually is a Pokemon tournament on. Yes. So like, are the guys competing for anything specific or is it just for the fun of it? Well, today, today is a league challenge. So they're playing for cup points. So they're playing to actually earn points to play at World Championships. Mm. World Championships, uh, the next World Championships should be in June, July next year. Yeah. And it's in Honolulu, Hawaii. So um, yeah, if, you, if they earn 200 points by playing in these challenges and cups, then they qualify and then they can uh, fly over to Hawaii and play at national, uh, not nationals, um, worlds oh, next crazy. year. That is insane. Okay, so I know that today we gathered here because we have a tournament of might on. So yeah. it's obviously all about Dragon Ball Z, clearly, as you can yeah. see from my t-shirt. So, okay, cool. Do you play the game at all? 
Uh, I play I play a bit, uh, but I don't play. I don't have time much. I don't have much time to play. I'm busy yeah. running, running a store. Yeah. yeah, you're literally a businessman, so yeah. I don't I imagine there isn't any time. Yeah. But when you play, who is your main character that you know? Or <sighs> your, if not the three, who is one of the characters you always choose when you do play it? Well, the, the newer the newer DBs I haven't played much, but like the older ones, I used to play Broly a lot. Ah. Uh, Broly, and I used to play Young Gohan, and but this is we're talking about old DBs now. Back yeah, in yeah, the that's day. Cool, so, cool. so Young Gohan mm-hmm. and um, Piccolo. Those are the, ah. the three men that I used to play back in the day. Very interesting. But, yeah. dude, we do appreciate your singers today. It was actually really cool. Thank you so much. Right, sure. And, guys, if you're looking for any card games, any board games, any games where you can play with your friends face-to-face, The Den is the place to find all of it. They are in Newton Park, Heard Street. You can't miss it. There's actually a massive sign out front that says The Den. <laughs> so, yeah. Peace out, guys. What's up, guys? I got my homie Sim with me, Grim Joe ZA, on YouTube. Okay, so he entered the tournament as well, and let's just say, yeah, we both uh, we both entered, and we're both standing here to do interviews now, which tells you a lot about how far we got. <laughs> but anyways, so homie, tell me more about your experience. How was the tournament? Because I know we don't really have a lot of tournaments in PE. Like this is one of the first that I've heard of. I know that we saw them. Well, we didn't actually f- have a fighting tournament at Connect when we went, but we played. Yeah, we played though. Okay, so like, tell me how was your experience today? What was it like? I know you're not, you're not a big Dragon Ball Fighter Z player, but still, how was your experience today? Uh, for sure, man. No, the experience was great, and uh, uh, just really happy to be here, to be part of the community. And uh, I was just smashing buttons and throughout, <laughs> right through the tournament. I think we were pulled smashing buttons. With, like I, I do play Fighter Z, but not as often as I want to. But it, yeah. it, it, it's cool, anyways. Okay, so based on what you when you played so far and how far you got, do you have a main character yet, or you're still figuring it out? Uh, honestly, I'd say it is uh, Goku, a uh, Ultra Instinct, ah. as well as Broly and uh, Krillin. Yeah. Oh wow! Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, were you playing with your favorite Dragon Ball like Z character in the game, or were you just playing with whoever was actually a decent character to play with? Yeah, well, as a Dragon Ball fan, um, I was just playing with the characters that I'm familiar with. Ah. Well, from the anime series, and uh, so I just. For the love of Dragon Ball Z, I was just playing to just have fun and uh, get to know the other guys in the community, and uh, which is the main thing. Yeah. Well, hopefully the community will grow a bit more. But anyways, guys, that's been me and Sim. We'll hop on some more interviews in a second. Yeah, man. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks, Omi. Catch you later. Hey guys, so we have Nathan with us right now and Nathan is the guy who I went up against in the tournament and yeah, as you could see by the interview I had earlier, I got knocked out really, really early. But Nathan is currently in the finals, which is dope. So, Nate, okay, so how was the experience today, bro? How was, okay, obviously, how was beating me, for starters, but also how was like the rest of the day so far, because you're actually in the finals right now. Uh, beating you was alright. <laughs> I heard uh, word, word on the street that you were the, like the best. So I just took all my, all my anger <laughs> because I really wanted to make it to the finals, get that manga, drag a ball, because I'm a big fan. Mm. But going to the finals is very nice. And I told my parents mm. that I will make it, and mm. here I am. Yeah, you are. No, don't, let the, don't let the t-shirt fool you. I'm, I'm, like, I'm not that good at this game. But <laughs> you did. Yeah, we, we actually had a tiebreaker. So Nate, I won the first round, Nate won the second. And then it was like the decider, but when the decider came, yeah, Nate, let me know what's up. So yeah, okay. So I know you've been playing the game, and from what I saw, I thought Goku Black was your main character, but who is actually your main character? My main character is actually uh, UI Goku. Mm. MUI. I saw that as well earlier. Because mm-hmm. yeah, when he pulled out that UI and he was like dodging everything I threw at him. But Goku, Goku Black is just like one of my characters that's been there. Mm. But UI is just my number one. Ah, okay. What other fighting games do you actually enjoy besides Fighters? Mortal Kombat, uh, Tekken, and uh, Naruto, and that's all. Ah, but those are dope fighting games though. But the way we do it, it was dope fighting, he was awesome. No hard feelings, it's all good. We're gonna catch you in the finals. We will actually catch Nate's battle in the finals, so you guys can check that out in the video as well. By the way, bro, good luck for later. Thank you. Peace. Ah! 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 Ah!
But going to the finals is very nice, and I told my parents that I will make it. I won. Congratulations guys, thank you very much, thank you.